I've tried to create in my practice a space that creates that milieu of quiet and ease. So you feel like I'm in the right place and I'm gonna be okay. I'm gonna heal or I'm in the right place. I'm gonna be able to reach my health goals for what I wanna accomplish in life. When I started thinking about being a doctor, I thought about what kind of doctor I wanted to be and I wanted to be a doctor in a community where the patients I treated were my friends and we had a relationship and I knew them and I knew their families. I just naturally believe that if you're going to heal somebody, you're going to help somebody be healthy, you're going to help them get the most and live the fullest in their life, then you got to know them. You have to know the context of their life. And so relationship is key. Knowing people is key. And that's the, that, that's the, the cornerstone of what makes me the doctor I am and how I interact with my patients. You can call it concierge medicine, you can call it uh, direct pay primary care, uh, you can call it what you want, but it's what I've been doing since I started practicing. I'm not going to be doing anything different except I'm going to create the time and space to be able to do it again because I'm going to be limiting the number of patients that I have. I'll be, you know, instead of having a panel of 2,500 patients to 3,000 patients, I'm going to limit it to 500 patients. Automatically, I'm going to have more time. More time to spend with my patients and not feel the pressure of being behind. More time in between seeing you and other patients to actually think about your case, to actually be able to talk to a specialist, be able to read all your reports, and to be able to more thoughtfully create a plan that will keep you healthy and get you to your, your wellness goals. One of the important things is that I'm the right doctor. And I read a lot, but I don't believe everything I read. I'm fairly insightful, and I know when somebody's telling me the truth, and I know when they're lying. And I have to do that day in and day out because patients don't always like to tell me everything. And I have to really try and work to get them to tell me the whole story. If a patient wants that kind of relationship, they want somebody who's going to challenge them, somebody who's going to help them and motivate them, and even find within them their dream and their motivation that they forgot a long time ago because they didn't think it could ever happen, that's the kind of doctor I am. If you're gonna work just as hard as I am, and even harder, I will be there to support you, motivate you, and cheer you on. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna demand a lot from you. But that's the only way you're gonna stay healthy, be well, and get the most out of your life that you can.